I'm Tracy Lawrence, and this is Mullet Over, Cowboy Edition. What makes a cowboy a cowboy? I think the willingness to work hard, to go the extra mile for people that are in need, uh, a guy that has a love and appreciation for the land, for the animals that, that are on the land, I think that's a big part of what makes a cowboy a cowboy. Cowboy boots should be shined. Uh, I shine mine every time before I walk on the stage, before I go out, I keep them polishing sponge with me everywhere I go. I've learned over the years, there's a certain way to brush your belts down. I keep all my cowboy hats in boxes. Uh, I go through a lot of straws because I sweat a lot on stage and they get bad sweat rings around them, so I move through several of those a year. I grew up in a small farm town in southwest Arkansas where it was part of the culture. I mean, Wrangler jeans from an early age, cowboy boots. You know, uh, dressing up and going out was, uh, was a nice felt hat. Uh, we had a lot of, of social events and things where everybody wore their cowboy hats. It was it was like your your good uh, your good clothes to go to a special event in. So that between that and all the rodeos that I grew up in, they were just part of the culture. Who's the best movie cowboy? It's got to be Clint Eastwood. Sheesh. Best cowboy hat in the game? Always George Strait. So I guess we've mulled over cowboys enough. Don't forget to listen to my brand new song when the cowboy's gone. <laughs>